I think there are many wonderful initiatives made by the Telangana government. I think maybe what really stands out is the increase in the tree cover in this state, which has increased with 7% in the last maybe one decade, which is an astonishing result. There are very few examples uh, of this anywhere in the world that you can do such a greening of a, a state uh, in such short time. So and very successfully done. So that's si simply to say big congrats to this and I hope we can also inspire many other states of India to do similar efforts. In the same lines, our MP uh, doing Green India Challenge to implement the greenery all over the India. How do you look at, at the Green India Challenge program? I think that showcase exactly what you need. I mean, without government leadership, we come nowhere. But you also need to add the power and the dynamism of civil society activists and groups, then you get a very, very strong combination. But let's not forget, without the chief minister's leadership, it's always very difficult. So I pay tribute to him, but also pay tribute to <laughs> the activists and the people who do the work on the ground, because not one man cannot do all this, and you need thousands upon thousands of people to do the uplifting. Uh, and then this in, in the challenge is a very, very important factor to support the vision of the chief minister. What is your message to younger generation? Uh, plant trees, is for sure, is very important. I mean, very, very many young people come to me and ask, can I do something? Does it matter what I do? Then I tell them, yes, it's a lot you can do. You should vote for politicians who are green. When you go to the shop, you should ask the businesses to go green. You can plant trees. Uh, you can ask for solar panels in your school or in your village. Uh, and you can avoid all the unnecessary single-use plastic. I mean, do we really need a straw when we drink and to drink straight from the strength, straight from the cup? There are small issues people can solve themselves, but that will also point to the bigger picture. Uh, all the changes only can happen, led by the poli political leaders and, and business. On the lines of Green India Challenge, we recently taken no plastic. Uh, usage of uh, reducing the usage of plastic. How do you give the message to uh, all the people on plastic uses? I think we should do three things at the same time. We should abandon all the plastics we simply do not need. I mean, our parents and grandparents didn't use straws. They, they didn't use single-use cutlery, which can be made from bamboo or from trees or from any other material. Secondly, we should look for new materials. If you want a straw, let's make it from bamboo. That's very good material, or make it from paper. There are so many other materials we can use. But at the end, there will be also be a lot of plastics which we do need because it serves good purposes in society, say to protect us better against bacteria during COVID. Or if you have a car here, the car will be lighter because there is more, because there's a lot of plastic in, in the car. That's good because then use less gasoline. Uh, but all the, that plastic needs to be recycled and used again. Thank you, sir.